Hello everyone, this is Miss Felicia and I am coming at you with my last, yes, my last, um, review about my Bobby Talk Indie Remy Ocean Way. Um, why is this my last one? Because I'm finishing it up and I'm getting me some new hair. It's coming in real tomorrow. It's coming in real tomorrow. Yeah, coming in real tomorrow. And the hair I'm going to get. I'm so excited. I can't wait until I get off for tomorrow. Because 10 stars are going to be here waiting on me. You know I'm going to be at work sneaking to the bathroom every hour, hour and a half. Going on UPS to see where it is. Because I'm in Memphis. And it's in Knoxville. Which is not that far from here. So. Okay, girl, but anyways, how about this? Um, I have the... Ocean Waves in A14 at the bottom, 12 at the top, don't do so the same length, why? Because it looks safe to me. Um, and I have a color 1B. Now, this hair, it's the same hair, same install from my Ocean Waves first impression video. And, um, that was, I think, two and a half months ago. I have a weave book. I think everyone should have a weave book. I keep up with my sewing. Um, with weave, I have tried. Little comments next to them just in case. I'd be like, hmm, why can't I stop using this? I don't know why. When I put my ends, I don't know what I could put it Um, I got it on the April the um, 19th. And it's June the 29th. So, going to be roughly two and a half, roughly two and a half months. I'm going to say two and a half months. But, um, yeah. It's two and a half months later. If you can tell the texture of it by me doing this, I don't know if you can tell, but if you can see how light it is and how it still moves, you see that? It moves pretty well. But, um, I still get oodles and oodles of compliments. I still get oodles, yes I said oodles, I said your oodles is compliment, um, it's still very soft, um, and it still looks very natural, I don't have a problem blending it with my natural hair, it blends very well, and it, it looks natural, sometimes I look at myself and be like, mm, that could actually be my hair, it could, it's not, but it could, but, um, yeah, I'm ready for it to be out, though. So. I'm gonna tell you why. Um, let's go down the list. Okay, what well, products I use on this hair? I use my Cantu Shea Butter um, shampoo and rinse out conditioner. I do not use a leave in conditioner on this kind of hair because of the simple effect they will weigh it down. This hair really isn't made for products, period. So, after I shampoo and conditioner, that really should be it. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. I do spray it every once in a while with my Dove Daily Moisture Therapy, which they don't even make anymore. I was so upset to find that out. So upset. You have no idea. I have been looking everywhere. I still look. Whenever I go anywhere and they have a, a shampoo aisle, I always go down and look, thinking maybe, just maybe, they might have one or two. They never do. They never do. <laughs> but if you see some, please get it. Because you won't see it again. And it's not expensive. It's like $3. And you know Dove is switching their line and everything. So it's probably on clearance or whatever. Anyways, um, those are the only products I use. My Bio Silk. Silk therapy on it the last two times I shampooed it this time and time before and I just put like a little dime size in my hand rubbed it while it was wet and just ran it through and then blow dried it and this one comes out and this wave panel right here I didn't curl it or anything I actually combed and blow dried it instead of diffusing I combed and blow dried it and I got this wave pattern I was very surprised I thought it was going to come out straight but it didn't um, tangling. Yes, I did experience some tangling, but there is a but with that. 
I got really annoyed with the hair, so I just stopped shampooing it. Quite I'm going to be honest, because it's tangly probably wasn't on the hair. It was probably on me because I stopped shampooing it for like two weeks. I just, I didn't, because I'm so over it. So, that could be my fault. It could be there. It could be my fault. So, don't take that too much to heart because I really don't know what made it do that. Um, but the reason I was so irritated was because of the shedding. I hate to say it, but this hair does shed. Not right off the back, but if you're doing long term, like this hair doesn't age gracefully. It, it does like this. It's good, and then it's slowly, slowly, yeah. Um, but the hair, just like the straight hair, the strands will come out in groups of between one and four. I'll say four. The only difference is with this hair, it does it all the time. Like, I never get handfuls or clumps of hair where it's, like, enough for you to braid. Because I see people get clumps with curly and straight hair enough for you to braid and, like, a full curl. But not with this. I don't get that much. I only I only get groups in between one and four. It's just all the time, it's like slowly, it's like you more strands on the countertop and on the floor and in your car and it's just like, oh, and then sometimes you'll feel, well, I'll feel something on my arm and be like, what is that? And maybe one strand that came out that's rubbing up against my arm. And it's just, it's like, it's nothing major, but it's just annoying. And I just like over it. That's why I just stopped shampooing it. And I was like, forget it. So I researched me some more hair and... You know, and another thing I didn't like about this hair is the fact that it did not revert back to its original wave pattern, which for some people may not be a big deal, but to me, it may have well been a deal breaker, because I love the straight hair. If I knew it wasn't going to keep its curl, I would have just got the, kept the straight hair. Got some more straight hair and curled it myself. I got the wavy hair because I thought I was going to stay wavy. Milky Way saw a Parisian glam can do it. Bobby Boss and the Remy should be able to do it better. But it ain't. It failed miserably. So, yeah. But, um, that's pretty much it. I didn't get a lot of shedding at a time, but it did shed. I didn't get a lot of tangling at a time. Like, I didn't, I never got, like, matting or, you know, the bird's nest in the back or nothing like that. It's just. Now, it did do a little tangling under here, but nothing that I couldn't run my fingers through. So never met it, and like I said, I never got bird's nest. But it's really hot down here, and it's really humid. And sometimes my air want to work, sometimes it don't, so my neck is sweating, and things happen, you know? But um, lately, I have been having an issue with tangling, so. I mean, it is what it is. I'm not even going to try to pull these strands out because I'm on camera. And this hair is funny acting. And since I'm on camera, I'm not going to get no strands. I'm, I'm not going to get no strands. Because it's funny. If you've been acting funny with me all this time, we have fun of the camera now. It's on this best behavior. Anyways. Now, my last part of my review. Will I purchase this hair again? No. Because I miss a long term hair, and this is not long term for me. Well, I suggest it. Yes or no. I would suggest it to anyone who's looking to either get a quick weave or sew in, but only have it in for like a month, a month and a half. I would absolutely suggest it. If I was to get my hair done for that short amount of time, I would purchase it again. But I do long term, so no. And if you're looking for something that's going to last you, Two, three months, no, I would not suggest it. So that's a yes and no. It depends on how long you want to keep it. Um, on the scale of one to ten, I would give it a seven point three. A seven point three. Which is not horrible, but considering all the factors of the shedding, the tailing, and the inability to revert back to the original curl. Yeah, seven point three. But that's pretty much it. Any questions, comments? or suggestions, let me know, and I'll be happy to give you a quick